What's up? <laughs> I'm out for another one of my walks and I thought I'd go ahead and take you along with me. Check this out. Look at all these hummers out here. Huh? What's going on over there? I don't know. It's kind of windy out here. That's why I haven't been taking the camera so much. But yeah, still going on these, trying to relax myself. Look at this. Fifteen bucks for the double grind. Yeah. It's always something freaky going on. <laughs> Got an RV place over here. Look, there's somebody with mowers. Yeah. Well, maybe I'll get myself an RV and see the country. <laughs> so anyway. I hope you're doing good. Look at that. Walk right over the fence. Man, I do not know about towing something like that behind me. Oh my god. This. That looks like you go on tour with that thing. Rockstar. Yeah, that's pretty wild. Exciting video, huh? You never know though. When I get the camera out, freaky stuff always happens. It just finds me. Just like the 7-Elevens are the bug light of the neighborhood. They attract everything bad. Me and this camera attract the freaky stuff. Whoa, I don't know if I can get out of here. I see a swamp right there. I don't want to get in that, so I'm going right here. Yeah. Whoop. I made it. Don't be scared. Yeah, that would be bad. I'm feeling pretty good. I've been feeling pretty good for a while now. You know, I've mentioned this before. I used to, well, I always kind of thought positive, but I didn't have that, like, you know, infomercial type of dude that's up there saying, you can be anything and you can do whatever you want in this world, you know, chase your dreams. I didn't have that. I'm behind a Pizza Hut. Yeah. I never had that. I always thought that was kind of like hogwash. And then, in my 30s, it hit me. My late 30s, I seeked it out from the power of positivity. And I started to actually utilize it in my life. And I tried to reprogram my brain. It was hard to do, but I did it. And I feel like I'm back there right now. I hear birds chirping, the sun is shining. I'm on a walk for my health. Unless I step in a hole and twist my ankle, then that wasn't too healthy. <laughs> now I know I could get my flat tires fixed right over here. Yeah. Got a vapor store. <laughs> it's my vapes. I'm cutting caddy corner. Yeah, got some cones down. Somebody has to come along here. Put that back up there. There you go. The lawnmower probably hit it. <laughs> I hope you're feeling good too. Oh man, hold on. I found a pedal on. Why not? We'll look at a pedal lawn. This is the lawn that you don't want to have to take care of. Now, why would this be a pedal lawn? Because there's weeds and stuff down in here and flags. 
But how are you going to get those weeds out of there without getting down on your hands and knees and doing some plucking? And it's got a gravel driveway. And it's an obstacle course. No flow. No flow. Now this is the opposite, but it still has this horrible ditch right here. Garbage. Man. Somebody needs to come along here and do some cleaning. Because I'm going to bring one of them sticks and a bag, a pouch. Look at this. They just mowed right over it. They just mowed it all up. Oh, look. Look at this can. That's been hit by a lawnmower, man. There's probably like 10 bucks worth of cans back there. Not really. <laughs> I've cashed in this crap and stuff before. It takes a lot of cans to get yourself a dollar. But it can be done. Now if somebody tore out... Wait a second, I see a handle. Or do I? What the hell? Look at that. Hit that with your lawnmower. Somebody did. Somebody hit that with their tractor. What the heck? You see? I told you, it's always a freaky scene. It never fails. Because you have to spot the things that nobody else spots. Yeah. You know, everybody's like, oh, la di da, nothing going on. And I'm like, hey, look at that thing growing out of here. <laughs> yeah. I'm also the one that finds money on the ground, too. <laughs> I found a $100 bill on the ground one time. Weirdest thing ever. It was a real $100 bill. But in my yards and stuff, I found money before. I found... I found my $30 that the person paid me, and then it came out the front door, paid me, and I stuck it in my pocket. And I must have went around to blow off the back, reached in my pocket for something. To Lost it. The very next week, I'm back at the yard, and start the front, when I get around to the back, it's right there on the sidewalk. Right in the middle of the sidewalk, $30. 20 to 10, fold it up, beep, right there. And I'm like, there's that $30. But then I'm like, you mean to tell me they haven't even walked out in their backyard all week? And that's where they put their trash out, out by the back gate? There you go. But hey, see, I lost my 30, then I found my 30, so. <laughs> Always good luck in the end. You have bad luck, then you have good luck. Always have, except for the good luck. Okay, we're gonna go in here. But I'm gonna switch to uh, my phone. I don't want to freak anybody out. I need a drink though. Quickie Mart. Need something to drink around right here. Hmm, what do I want? Don't need an energy drink. I think what I need is a vitamin water. Hey, what's up, man? Are you okay? Focus. I need to focus. Gotta stand in line now. People are used to cameras and phones now. Hey, how you doing? Hi. Is this it for you? Yeah, that'll be. You have all. a kickback card? No, it's okay though. It'll be two twelve. <laughs> All right, we'll see you later. Nice day. Two. All right. Focus factor. <laughs> oh, it's good. That's where I went in over here. Now I'm walking past a Waffle House, everybody's favorite. Don't be scared of Waffle House. 
they need to do some yard work. Yeah, they need all kinds of stuff. Uh, oh god, is it, is it abandoned? <laughs> that looks abandoned to me. Yeah. Waffle House moved in, they moved out. <laughs> uh oh. Grasshopper mowers. Yeah. Grasshoppers out here, I would assume. You see those and Dixie Choppers. Scad. Yeah. You know where I'm at? I don't know where I'm at. I go for a walk in different places all the time. I hop in, I drive around. And I go, hey, this looks like a freaky scene. I get out, and there you go. Look. It's got a lawnmower in the bed of his truck and a big old trash can. Around here, I think you definitely need the trash can. Can we cut all the way through here? Why not? It's a bank. If they ask what I'm doing out here, I'll just say, I was wondering if you guys could break this $20 bill for me. <laughs> Someone slicked this off. Yep. You know, there's a time to take life serious, and then there's times that you can't take life serious. Because if you're thinking about stuff so much, you worry yourself. I think the wind's blowing this way. Might make it better for you. I can walk backwards good, because I'm used to like trimming. It feels natural if I was trimming. Right down the sidewalk. I go right this groove right here. See, I'm not taking things seriously. Right now I'm trying to forget about any problems that I have, any worries or thinking ahead too far, what's going on in the future. I'm trying to focus on the weird stuff, the different stuff, things that you get caught up in your life and you overlook. The birds chirping, the shade under the tree, sun everywhere else. Might be time for another swig. Yeah. So that's the point of these walks. The point of these talks. Well, I don't even know what I said so far. I think I see a, another truck and trailer coming. I'm a, definitely a magnet to like lawn care <laughs> trailers and trucks. That's a bobcat. Yeah, another rare one, see? Dixie choppers, grasshoppers, and bobcats. Still gotta find a skag. Look, another one that I think is abandoned. Yeah. Because it has this here. And, you know, there's stuff growing over the steps. Like, you wouldn't, well, some people <laughs> will leave that there and live with, you know, weeds growing up on their doors and stuff. I mean, not me. Man, they had to move all these. New grass. Hold on, let's hear this. Nope, it's not making noise. <laughs> all right. Boy, you gotta be careful here, too. Come over there, man. Destroy your mower. Wow, you know what? I've reached the end of the road. Which means it's the end of the video. Wait, I hear a weed eater. That's it. Time to focus on the walk. <laughs>